malnutrition is is when an individual isn't getting enough nutrient it can be one nutrient or a variety of nutrients um, in their diet or in other ways to maintain optimal body function immune function all of that muscle mass um, it usually can be caused from an, um, not taking in the right amount of nu nutrients through diet, but it can also be caused by diseases such as cancer that affect the digestive tract so that even if you take in uh, the right nutrients, your body isn't able to digest them and use them properly. Um, it can also be, malnutrition can also be caused by changes in um, your, bo your body's ability to absorb nutrients from your GI tract, and again, that can um, be caused by various diseases, including cancer, and even a change in metabolism that can happen from a variety of diseases like cancer, diabetes. People fighting cancer become, can become malnourished um, for a variety of reasons. Uh, one, we know cancer itself can affect um, someone's ability to take in um, digest, absorb, and or metabolize nutrients properly. Um, so depending upon what type of cancer someone has, any one or all of those steps can be impacted. So it can be difficult for somebody to take in food or they might not be able to digest it properly, et cetera. Um, and then on top of that, many or most cancer treatments can also impact any of those steps, the ability to take and digest, absorb, and metabolize nutrients. So we have a disease that makes it difficult for people to take in the right amount of nutrients, and then the treatments that are effective in managing the disease can also impact those, uh, those same steps as in, in one's ability to take in the right nutrients. Malnutrition is common in people with cancer. Um, according to the National Cancer Institute, um, 20 to 40 percent of people with cancer um, can become malnourished. Um, and in fact, a similar amount can actually die from malnutrition or complications from malnutrition. Um, so that's one statistic from the National Cancer Institute. Institute. Um, a variety of other research studies tell us, depending upon what type of cancer you have, for example, cancers of the in cancers of the digestive tract, sometimes 80 to 90 percent of people with those types of cancer can become malnourished. Um, so the, the prevalence is high, and unfortunately, um, the result of um, malnutrition, if it's not treated, can be very serious.